Here's a simple pulse motor project with a bit of a twist. A few weeks ago you might remember I made this one and outside in bright sunlight it would rattle along. And it's basically just the internals from one of these dancing flowers you can get from Poundland or Dollar Tree. And then I used the magnet from the inside of one of these cordless motors. I just put that on a pin and the uh, propeller on the end. And then depending on the height of the two pieces of wire, one either side that support it, just make a little circle and that supports um, the rotor, then you can get the thing to spin around. And I thought, well, I can make one a bit better than that one. So that's what I've done. And the thing being, depending on how big you make the circle, you can get a rattling effect that to me sounds a bit like an actual engine. So we'll, we'll start this one up. Do with a cranking handle as well. Oh. There we go, and if I put the uh, camera nearer to it, it'll go out of focus, but you might agree, that sounds a bit like a real engine. There's a good clash effect to it. It's also influenced by what it's sat on. So uh, this is on a, a candle thing with a lot of internal air volume. It sounds really good on that radio there. But I just thought, that sound itself makes the thing worth making. I've got the three panels there on the left um, which are in parallel to give them you know, enough current to start this thing up. It might be a good one for the two transistor complementary pair circuit as well. But I just like the sound of it. Okay, thanks for watching.